Welcome back to Alkaline TV. This is Douglas Dennis, the Alkaline Chef. Today I want to go through this huge grocery haul we got. And also there's one thing that was already out. So they ran out of it even though I ordered it. They were out of it by the time we got it so we weren't able to get it and I'll share that with you at the end. Oh yeah. Brazil nuts. That looks really good. Oh yeah, more Brazil nuts. What is this, two pounds? Oh yeah! Look at that! Giant bag of hemp hearts. Oh, agave? Oh, stay syrup. <laughs> agave syrup. I mean, this better be a hundred percent. Yes. Date syrup. A freaking gallon of it. <laughs> that is like Christmas. Wait, what's this? Brazil nuts. Oh. Yeah, that's the same brand. They changed their logo. They changed their look. Date sugar. Oh man. Wow. Coconut cream powder. Oh man. That's exciting. Wow. Okay, so there's a couple things I didn't talk about. It's this and this. These are chickpeas. These are, this is spelt flour. Unifine, it's organic. If you don't know spelt flour, that is what I eat instead of wheat. No wheat on this channel. And this is dark rye flour. And then this is quinoa. This is white quinoa. And there's one thing, can you see me in here? There's one thing we didn't get because they were out. So we did not prep well enough in advance. Elderberries are out. Luckily, I still have some, but trying to prep them. They were on my list. I mentioned them in my last video about stocking up and a food shortage. And there's definitely seems to be a shortage of elderberries. I think there was already a shortage of elderberry before this all happened anyway. So if you've got some elderberry, if you have a source for organic elderberries, again, don't get that nonsense syrup if you want to make the syrup yourself out of whole elderberries, great. But don't buy that stuff in the store. I talk about it a million times. It has added chemicals in it. Hope that helps, and I will be eating all this now.